Hey guys, it's ASMR Baby Axo. Today I mostly wanted to do a soft spoken update for you guys, but I also figured that I would add in some coloring sounds and um, these adult color books are something I've really gotten into lately. They're very therapeutic, and it says, as you can see, relieve stress and improve focus with art. Coloring for adults, the perfect way to relax. So, I have my color pencils, which I need to invest in some better kinds with different colors. I have these, a little sharpener, and I can sharpen some of them and I can do some coloring while I update you guys on what's been going on in my life. Um, so, let's see. I've been working on two different pictures in here, but I really like this one because you can just do, I'm doing just like random colors and flowers. I think it's Pretty cool, and it inspires the creativity. So, I have my pencils. Most of them are sharp. And I do apologize if this video isn't super relaxing. As I said, I mainly wanted to update you guys, but try to add some elements of ASMR into it. I have these. I have pink, dark green, red, white, yellow, orange, purple, dark blue, light green, brown, black, and light I'm going to start with pink, I think. I'm going to give this one a quick little sharpen. So, where have I been? I'm sure it's something a lot of you have been asking, especially with all of my new subscribers, which I do want to give a huge thank you to you guys for. We are at 19,000 subscribers, going on 20,000, which I find to be absolutely phenomenal. I mean, that's just to me a crazy number that I never thought I'd see. And it's happened very quickly, like within the last couple of months. And I've had my channel, if you guys didn't know, since 2012, I believe. And so, as you can imagine, um, I've had quite an explosive amount of growth in the last two or three months, and I mostly attribute it to um, just really upping my amount of content that I've been producing and trying to up the quality, even though I don't have the best equipment. and. That's something I've been getting a lot of comments about as I've been getting more subscribers. Sorry, my AC just kicked on, but, um, you know, it's just asking about me getting a better mic, um, a better camera, or whatever, and people asking to donate, and as I've said in the past, I, I had considered opening up PayPal for donations, but I don't, I don't know, I don't want to ask for donations. I truly appreciate all of the offers. But I just don't want to feel, I don't want anyone to feel like I owe them. And I don't want to accept donations knowing how here and there I can be with my videos and content. And it's just not something I'm fully comfortable doing at this particular moment in my life. But someday I do, you know, think that I will definitely be getting better equipment. 
Um, we'll just see. So, for now, I'm doing the best that I can as a college student and uh, who only can work part time, uh, etc. So, where have I been the last month? It's been a pretty busy and hectic month for me. If you follow my Twitter page, you might have seen some of what is going on. If you don't follow my Twitter page, um, I'll leave the link in the description box where it always is, but it's just ASMR BBXO, like my YouTube name, and it's, I, sometimes I'll post updates on there um, to kind of keep you guys in the loop, so if I'm not posting on YouTube, you will probably see updates from me on the Twitter page, so make sure you follow that. So, firstly, this month, I ended up going on vacation, right after I made my last, most recent video, which lasted 10 days. Um, when I got back, I had a lot on my plate with work and actually moving apartments. Um, I am in a new apartment now, and we have been moving boxes and packing and unpacking and getting things settled, as you can imagine. Um, I do live with my boyfriend now, which is really nice. So we're doing very well and we're really happy. Um, it's nice because we're able to get all of our own furniture and belongings into here. We weren't really in the best um, setup previously. We were living in these pre-furnished apartments and with our friends and it just wasn't always the best situation to say the least but um, the way we are now is much much better so I need to figure out a new setup for filming uh, which I'll be doing soon and you can expect more ASMR content from me in the coming weeks hopefully um, and then aside from moving and work and vacation, I actually had a pretty big um, medical crisis. Um, I ended up going in for a routine physical exam for um, school. And this was something I hadn't done in years, which was silly of me. So this is partially my fault. Um, but basically, I'm not gonna go into too much detail because I feel it's a bit personal but they found a problem and I spent days in the emergency room and doctor's offices getting scans and tests run to figure out what was wrong with me um, and we ended up determining I was gonna need surgery so I actually just underwent surgery this past week um, it's been 10 days since my surgery and I'm recovering quite well the surgery went amazing like better than expected um, and everything is fine now I'm healthy and getting back to my old self very quickly the first few days of recovery were pretty rough um, but as I said I'm really regaining my strength now and getting back to normal it was an abdominal surgery so um, that can be pretty taxing <laughs> and I've been down and out for a while so it's nice to be regaining my strength and getting back to normal although it will take me a few more weeks to be fully healed um, and be able to go back to work I'm not able to work at the moment so I'm just kind of stuck in my new apartment but I don't mind so much um, but yeah, things are getting back to normal. It's been a pretty crazy month, and that's why I haven't been around to post anything for you guys. And I'm really sorry, but life happens sometimes. And school actually starts back for me next week, next Monday. So that's going to be a thing. And then when I start working again, that's going to be something else. Um, I won't be able to post as much as I did during this summer. But I do still plan on posting as much as I can for you guys. So, you know, stay tuned for that. Something me and my boyfriend have actually been talking about and thinking about is um, starting a vlog channel, like a couple
up this vlog channel where we do like weekly vlogs um, and just kind of upload little tidbits of our day and our life and do like um, tags and challenges and just try to do entertaining things for you guys so that's definitely a little bit different but if it's something y'all would like to see from us definitely let me know it won't be ASMR based but uh, I think it will be pretty cool to say the least um, for us to have kind of a project to work on together um, so I don't think there's much else wanted to update you guys on um, other than those things I'm so grateful for those of you that have stuck around through my absence and I'm so grateful also for all of um, my new subscribers as I said and you guys can definitely expect to see more from me I'm always taking requests I don't make like personal videos and personal requests um, I've been getting a lot of questions about that like um, if I would make a special video for a certain price um, that's also not something that I really feel comfortable doing so I hope you guys understand I'm really sorry about that but I don't do patreon or anything I'm just exclusively a youtuber for the time being so uh, yeah, I do appreciate all of you though I hope you're all doing wonderful and I wish you all the very best as always always trying to spread love and light to all of you guys so I've been getting lots of requests to do um, just kind of chatty videos talking about like my spirituality or veganism my journey in veganism things like that so uh, if you guys would like to see more chatty type videos where I talk about different aspects of my life let me know because I'd love to do that for you if we do the vlog channel that's definitely something you'd see a lot more of also so I think that that's something we're really considering doing together because it would be fun and also kind of help out Financially, maybe if we have enough people watching so you guys I'll let you know if we ever open that up and you guys should definitely check it out um, But yeah I'll finish this little rose for you guys I hope this is even relaxing It is very relaxing for me It really helps me chill out I like doing it, watching TV or chilling out on the couch I'm sitting on my floor right now which isn't the most comfortable thing we're still getting all of our furniture in but we've been so blessed um, with everything like our families have really been contributing and um, we've gotten a lot of furniture donated to us we got some vintage couches from the 70s which are so super cool uh, and we got a dining room table which is very nice um, we've just been super blessed and even though things have been crazy and a lot's been going on I'm super grateful for um, all of the wonderful blessings that I have in my life and I think that's key when you're going through hard times and facing difficulties, financial, health, um, anything, anything at all that you're facing, family, relationships, um, staying grateful and positive, keeping a positive mindset and focusing solely on the things that you are blessed with and that you do have and that you're grateful for, it's something really um, rewarding keeps you um, from being depressed and uh, being super down and out on yourself you know, I'm not saying you know if you have an actual mental 
illness. I know that sometimes just being positive doesn't solve your problems, but it does help a lot with your mindset and just really uh, trying not to get down in the dumps. So it's something I try to do every day. I keep a little journal where I like to make gratitude lists every day and write down things that I'm grateful for, even if it's something small or things that we take advantage of every day or take for granted. Things like food to nourish our bodies, um, a roof over our head. I don't know if you guys have heard, but um, southern United States, especially Louisiana, which is where I live, um, has been devastated by floods the last few days. Uh, so many people have lost their homes. Some people have lost their lives. The water um, has hit record-breaking levels since the 1940s, which is so scary and sad and devastating. And where I live, luckily, um, we didn't see too much damage. We did have widespread damage across our town and our parish. In my home, our apartment didn't see any water damage, which is such a blessing. And uh, I'm just I'm so heartbroken for all of the people who have had their lives and their homes just uprooted and destroyed. And uh, things like that really open your eyes and make you realize that you know people everywhere are struggling with things so much worse than the trivial things that we see day to day not all of us only see trivial problems some of us do have big time hardships but there are people with much worse problems at times and we should always keep them in our thoughts and send prayers or good vibes or whatever you send out to those people and keep in mind our gratitude and our blessings. Sorry I've gotten kind of rambly, <laughs> but I'm still kind of scatterbrained <laughs> from surgery. They say it uh, can really make you all over the place and I have been. So I'm in my little petal on the inside. I don't know what color to make it. Let's see. Let's do a dark green. But I like doing the random colors. <laughs> it's been fun. So I'm going to finish working on this one. I've actually... something really fun. It might seem childish to some of you, but I find it super therapeutic and relaxing. So, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and count your blessings, <laughs> and a relaxed and stress-free on this wonderful Sunday afternoon. So, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you very soon with a new ASMR video. Bye guys.